I'm setting up here for a hip thrust. You wanna make sure everything is centered on your hips. I bring the bar all the way to my hip crease and I sometimes have to like parallel park the weights so that I am equal on both sides. Then I bring my feet as close to my body as I can, pulling up under those hips and then I kind of adjust my feet so that when I'm at the top of that hip thrust, I'm completely 90 degree angle through that knee. I have a nice brief hold at the top. Exhale as you thrust up. Up, tuck the chin look to the wall in front of you and then everything below your last rib cage is moving towards the bench or the box whatever you're using everything above t stays pretty stationary keep tucking that chin make for a nice double chin action and look to that wall out in front of you also at the top of the movement, I kind of bring the bar down onto my quads just slightly. You could see it there just a little bit. It's a little sensitive to have it in that groin area for me. So at the very, very top, I extend my arms all the way and the bar kind of travels onto the meat of my quads.